I've got responsibility for um, looking after the route between Admiralty Arch and Buckingham Palace here behind us. So it's looking after the security of the, the processional route and, and managing the crowds that are going to turn up on the day. An awful lot of time is spent looking, we have to look at the route, we have to look at the numbers potentially that are going to be coming here, um, just look at um, the setup how the, the media build goes around, on around here as well because that obviously impacts on the amount of crowds that will be in the area. So there's lots and lots of things we have to look at in advance of the day. We're expecting tens of thousands of people. We've got a very robust policing plan in place. Um, certainly down here on the Mall, we maintain the, the sterile roadway, the, the roadway will be kept clear of uh, pedestrians. Um, and we've got officers that are going to be lining the ceremonial route and we've got officers that will be in and amongst the crowd as well talking to them dealing with them because we've got to look after the crowds that are here as well because this is a, an ideal opportunity for people to come and also not cause disorder but have um, big opportunist crime take place because there's so many people here so we need to make sure we look after the safety and well-being of members of the public that have come to view this event. No, this is a tried and tested event in terms of it's, it's a similar event to uh, the Troop in the Colour, the Queen's Birthday and the State Opening of Parliament, especially on this route. So we've policed this many, many times, so we know what's involved with it. Obviously on this occasion it's on a lot larger scale with the amount of uh, the crowds that are going to be here, but we have a plan to deal with that and we will deal very quickly and very decisively with anybody who tries to interfere with the integrity of this event.